So, Kathy Griffin suspended from Twitter for impersonating Elon Musk. If you don't know who Kathy Griffin is, is that redhead lady? Remember when she did the beh- the Donald Trump head, the severed head, and then she just had it hanging, and then she got canceled, and she lost her uh, that New Year's thing when she's there for hours and stuff. Yeah, that one. So the New York CNN and business Twitter has suspended comedian Kathy Griffin for impersonating the company's new owner Elon Musk. Yes, you heard that correctly. She is dabbling in elections. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, bro, we just started, and there's already drama. So, Griffin appeared to be the first celebrity to lose her tweeting privileges after a wave of prominent users impersonating Musk over the weekend with the goal of underscoring potential flaws in the social media company plans for a uh, revised verification system. So, they're trying. That's cap. What this girl did, she straight up, <laughs> she impersonated Elon Musk. Put, put his name, picture, everything, and just started going ham on it. And it's like, girl, like, you do understand this is cap, right? You, you've you been screwed before. Oh, God. So Musk has made an $8 Twitter subscription plan, his signature bid to bolster the company's revenue. The new plan was hastily rolled out over the weekend before the company ultimately decided to delay the service until after the midterms, right? <laughs> what is a surprise? I think it's already out. But the updated Twitter Blue subscription plan gives paying users the ability to get a blue check mark in their profiles, an option previously available exclusively to verified celebrities, politicians, journalists, and other public figures. Must propose a new feature as a way to fight spam on the platform. So, yeah, people are still butthurt about the blue check mark. Remember, there's all kinds of fake stuff going on. Like, oh, I want to be verified. Hey, I know a guy and I know a guy. You know, and it's already proven. You know, Elon got the blueprints. I'll pay you a couple thousands and you get me verified because if you have the blue checker mark, you're somebody apparently. So now all those people that have that power are now pissed off because they're like, yo, now the average person can have a Twitter. That's not right. What the hell? Then what's the point of it? And it's like, yo, journalists, I hate to tell you this, but the thing about Twitter is that everybody has a say, including the average look, Joe. No matter how dumb your comment is, the whole point is bring everybody in the table and you get called out when you say dumb stuff. It's simple as that. Comedian Sarah Silverman used her verified account to troll Musk, copying his profile picture over image and name. The only thing distinguished a tweet coming Silverman's account was the at Sarah Silverman handle. Quote, she said, I am a freedom of speech absolutist and I eat duty for breakfast every day. So she tried to be ironic and funny. Like, oh, I'm a, I'm a clown this man and his own account. <laughs> you know, I'm a doo-doo head. <laughs> but I was like, bro, this kind of ain't good. Come on, you know you're going to get fucking freaking slashed, right? The thing is, people think Twitter works the same way it did before, where it's like a double standard, where if you're a celebrity or you're, you know, you can get away with stuff as long as a narrative goes toward the liberal side you're good it's not like that no more so obviously this lady gets her you know she gets slashed because obviously you're impersonating somebody what do you think's gonna happen girl you're gonna lose your profile so she freaks out obviously right you know these people but the thing is uh, elon apparently he just gives them a warning like hey you need to change your profile picture and this and so you can go right back and if you want to continue your check mark ma- ma'am if you want your stuff to still run We'll pay $8 a month, which is like a... Woo, you know they hate that. They hate that so bad. But at the end, they're all like, obviously the media is like, yo, man, Elon Musk already canceling people. And it's like, well, yeah, she, she messed up. She didn't learn her first time, you know, going extreme, showing a beheaded head of freaking a president. Well, he wasn't a president yet. Uh, a person running for president in that time, I believe. I don't think he was president yet, but... Bro, you should know better. Come on. So, I mean, she's not the only one that did this stuff. I think H3, H3 Podcast. So, that guy is notorious for all kinds of drama. That dude used an H3 profile trying to make it as uh, Elon Musk. And the same thing, too, with him. He got his account banned. And I think these people can get their account back just as long as they change the profile back. And I mean, because... You have to remember, people forget, verification means that you are a verified person that we know who you are. If you are a verified account and you're changing your profile to something you're really not, 
then the verification doesn't make any sense. So it's like, yeah, we're gonna cancel your account because you are breaking rules of services. This is what playing by the rules is. But a lot of people are so used to getting away with this crap. Bro, this is common sense. I don't know how people do not understand this. And again, Twitter blue ain't for everybody. 90% of people ain't gonna use it. And that's fine. I mean, dude, apparently Elon Musk is like, bro, <laughs> you you didn't just, you know, impersonate somebody, you impersonate the owner of the whole freaking app. What do you think is gonna happen? You know, let's be honest. If it was the other side, you would have been perma banned like a lot of people in the Republican side were getting. They would just got perma banned, not even get a question, wiped out clean, never heard of again. We're gonna screw your whole life. And, uh, and then, you know, they're all connected and stuff. They're all, you know, they do horrible things. Look at this side. Look, look at what's going on now. You get a second chance, sir. You didn't do something right. Change your stuff back, or if not, you get permabanned. And you get your account back. But pay you $8 of Twitter Blue. <laughs> so, yeah. What do you guys think, huh? You think Elon to trolling? Uh, do you think... He's doing the right thing. I think this is just equality on his finest right now. But tell me what you think. Like and subscribe, comment on my stuff, and that'll be all. Cheat my.